Dun, 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 uh. Hey YouTube, my name is Luke, and today I'm going to be doing my first ever YouTube video. I'm really excited about this, so let's get into it. Every YouTuber has a cringy first start, am I right? So today, we're going to be discussing a watch. It's called the watchdesign.com planisphere watch. You can purchase this from watchdesign.com and it comes with a lot of beautiful features, including a cloth and a presentation pillow. It's really neat and it is a low cost of $70 if you can get that. Um, I got it for my birthday this year, earlier this year. So it comes first with this beautiful box and it just has on the front watchdesign.com. All of these materials are completely recyclable, so that's good. So if we open up the box here, of course I've already worn it before, so it's, it's going on, so it's not perfectly in. So first you're going to get this beautiful cloth. So when you have, so like, like glasses, you have a cloth with glasses. My, this watch has a cloth with it. So you can see like it has, it has the moon right here. It has the Apollo landing and some other ancient astronomy features. And on the back, it has watchdesign.com. They really want you to know that this is a watchdesign.com watch. So in case you want to polish it up a little bit, I like to do that a lot. You can use this. Also, there's the watch itself. Now, my favorite part is, here's the watch. I know, it looks beautiful. Now, what this is, is in case you don't know yet, I haven't said, it's a planisphere watch. Now, for those of you who don't know what that is, this is basically a star chart watch. And it tells you the constellations in the night sky based on what time and date you're looking at it. So, it comes with this beautiful presentation pillow. My mom calls it a diaper. It's clearly a pillow. So it comes with this, and what you do is once you set it, I don't know if you can see that, but it has the constellations right here along in the green there. And so what you do is you turn this, turn this, the bezel, and you align it. So right here is the time, and then right along here, if, if you look closely, once you have the watch, you can see the date. So once you align the time right here and the date along here, you will get the stars for that time and date. Let's look at some more features of the box. Of course, there's no watch without any instructions, and this watch is pretty complex. So here's the instructions, just a simple one page. And then right at the bottom, just warranty crap. So right here let's read the instructions for it so it says congratulations on your ownership of this most unique timepiece this design is inspired by large star maps and has been simplified to display the most common constellations in the northern hemisphere night sky right on your wrist let's see how to set it now when you get this watch when you get this watch it's going to have a clip right here it's just going to be weird. It's a, just a little clip right here on the bottom of the crown. And before you wear this watch, before you use it, you're going to have to remove the clip because that preserves battery life while the watch is in transit, while it's on the road to your home. So after you remove the clip, you're going to push the crown back in and then you're going to pull it back out. I'm not going to do this because I have a watch here and I don't want to mess it up anyway. So once you do is you just pull the crown in like pretty much all analog watches in the world. You twist, you twist the crown clockwise or counterclockwise and it will set the time. Now the time can be a little difficult to read if you don't have good eyes. This is a watch for um, people with good eyes. So you want to make sure that you have good eyes here. So you can see the time if you look closely. So you can see the hands here. So if, if you look closely, you can see the hands right there. So, so after that, you're going to push the crown back in, and then you have the time set. Now, when you get this, just keep in mind, it does have a second hand. Most watches don't have a second hand. This does. So I was actually surprised when I saw that it did have a second hand. So then after that, this thing right along here, 
This is called the bezel. And what this is, is you basically turn it and it does certain functions. This is with a chronograph watch. It can be with a GMT watch. This one is for a star chart watch. These actually are really uncommon and you're not going to find these with a lot of other videos. So when you look at it, it isn't really all that bad of a video, is it? So what you do is, I know it's hard to see, so what you do along this is numbers, those are times, and along the entire edge of the watch, those are dates. What you're gonna do is you're gonna align this time with the date out here, and then you're going to get the star chart for that day. So let's say just some random date, July 1st at 8 p.m. So that's in daylight saving time. That's a little complicated, we're not gonna do that. Let's just say January 1st at 8 p.m. Let's just do that. So what we're gonna do is we're going to align 8 p.m. right there and we're gonna twist it all the way around. You can see the compass directions right here, north, west, and east. Now up here, that's south. A lot of plants for watches, they don't have all directions, but just keep in mind that the top is going to be south for this watch. So keep, just keep watching. So we're going to keep twisting it all the way until 8 p.m. lines up with January. So around that, January 1st. So now that we have 8 p.m. along with January 1st, here's the night sky. So if we take a look at that, in the north, we have Cepheus. In the east, we've got Cancer and Gemini. Orion's my favorite constellation, by the way. Um, west, we have Aquarius setting. And then in the south, we have um, Eridanus, Cetus the Whale. We've got that constellation those constellations. So, um, it's pretty simple to wear. I have very little wrist, so this is truly a watch for adults. And, um, but if you are somehow in this world a kid like me, um, you're going to have to, um, tighten this up a bit. Um, with this, it's 3 ATM water resistant, so it is water resistant for 30 minutes up to one meter. And it's made in Japan and into China. It is also stainless steel. The back is really cool. Um, I'll show you that. So the back's really cool. And I usually just use the presentation pillow just like this and just lay it down just like that. But if you want to tighten it up and makes it look better, you can do that. So the back of the watch right here is really pretty. It says watchdesign.com planisphere watch. And it has a lot of things around the edge here. Um, it also has a patent number so you know how many other nerds out there have this watch this is about the six millionth watch that has ever been made by this it has rubber straps so i mean that's just about it for this video i hope you guys liked it um i know some may consider this boring i consider it fun so if there are any other people out there who like this stuff like this watch i highly recommend that you purchase it if you can afford it so Thank you for watching this video. I've always wanted to say this. Make sure you like the video, share it, comment, and most importantly, subscribe to my channel for more content. I was thinking if I have 10 subscribers by the end of the month, I may make videos every week, maybe even more often. Thank you guys for this video. Can't wait to do another one. See you later.